Welcome back everyone. This video is a tribute to all the stars who created wonderful memories for us, and we honor their lasting legacy. But before we start, let me know if you recognize any of the following actors and actresses. When did you notice them for the first time and how old were you? Do you have any particularly nostalgic recollections of them? Let me know in the comments section below. Betty Compson was a pioneering actress in Hollywood's silent film era, appearing in over 200 films throughout her career. She was nominated for an Academy Award for Best Actress in a Leading Role in 1929 for her performance in The Barker. She continued acting in sound films and television shows, but her career declined in the 1950s. Dick Clark was an American radio and television personality, widely recognized as the host of the music and dance show American Bandstand. He was a pioneer of rock and roll, and his show played a significant role in popularizing the genre. Clark died in 2012 due to a heart attack, leaving behind a legacy that helped shape the landscape of American popular culture. Frances Rafferty was an American film and television actress who appeared in over 30 films throughout the 1940s and 1950s. She is best known for her role in the 1946 film The Time of Their Lives alongside Bud Abbott and Lou Costello. Rafferty also had a successful television career, including a recurring role on December Bride in the 1950s. Kay Linacker was an American actress and screenwriter. She appeared in over 70 films, including The Maltese Falcon and The Body Snatcher. She also co-wrote several screenplays, such as The Leopard Man and The Curse of the Cat People. Linacker passed away at the age of 94 in 2008 due to natural causes. Peter Dennis was a British actor known for his work on stage, television, and film. He had a long career, appearing in over 100 plays, as well as films such as Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves and The Chronicles of Narnia, The Lion, The Witch and The Wardrobe. Dennis was also a prolific voice actor, lending his voice to many animated series and audiobooks, including the popular Harry Potter audiobooks. <laughs> 